to God, to God, to God be the glory. Amen. I really want to express my gratitude to a lot of you. Um, just to say thank you. Yes. You know, when this journey began in December 12, 2021, <laughs> I did not think I was able to do it. No, I did not come in thinking, yeah, I I'm going to be able to trash this out. I'm going to be able to do it in the very way the Lord wants me to do it. No, it was with all humility and still in humility because by myself, I can do nothing. I do that which I see my father do. But do you know the amazing part of it? It was done with each and every one of you supporting all the way. Yes, the beautiful you, the amazing you, the wonderful you, the excellent you, <laughs> the light that you are. For many people, you know, since we began, you've been here. We've been revealing Jesus in us together. We've been learning through the corrections, through the rebukes, through the prophetic words, through the encouraging one another, through the tears, through the joy, the laughter, the humor that Holy Ghost keeps revealing in each and every one of us. And knowing that coming here every day to serve each and every one of you brings joy to my spirit because it's an amazing moment in time. Sometimes the Lord takes us so quickly and sometimes he slows us down. Sometimes, you know, when we're like, Lord, I don't think I can do this anymore. But by the spirit, he lifts us up so that we know that we do not depend on the flesh. We depend on the spirit. Can you see that even in our weaknesses, he makes us strong so that we know that he that is in us is far greater than he that is in the world. So majority of you, I really want to express my gratitude for your prayers, most importantly. That to me is an absolute gift. And I just want to say thank you for you being able to mention me, this channel, before the presence of God. I basically, in humility, say thank you. The love that each and every one of you, you know, through the prophetic word, through a word of prayer, that you have shared i really want to say thank you to all of you you all have been absolutely amazing and words cannot basically express how much no no amount of words can express you know how much i appreciate and love you all love the very foundation of which this channel is and i just want to say thank you to you for expressing that love at the same time you know and in that regard i don't want to miss out those who have been persecuting those who have been critically coming through at the same time criticizing i want to really say thank you because you are the reason why we continue to ascend higher yes because of what you do you know we ascend higher you take us higher because the bible declares it was a persecution that broke out in the church hence the reason why the gospel continued to press forward so i want to say thank you at the same time you know and for those who have been you know giving and those who have been you know doing the best that you can and following the instructions of the Lord I want to say thank you because I know sometimes these teachings some of you might not absolutely get it once and for all but it's a seed that has been planted because eventually it will be revealed in you and the reason why I said that is because when it was first revealed to me <laughs> I remember I went before you know as soon as I heard you know about my identity I, I went to the Lord and I was like, you know, by the time I uttered those words, I actually realized that I was speaking exactly what Peter was speaking in the Bible. And he said, who can accept such things? <laughs> yeah, who can accept such things? Like, who? How, how can we accept such words? You know, and Jesus was like, are you going to leave me? And he said, no, you have the word of life. So through your heart, willing to receive from the Lord. Now, majority of you have come to understand that you're not a slave, you're a son. Can you see? And I'm grateful because it was not by power, nor by might, but by the Spirit. I can't take credit for what God is doing in your lives. It, all glory belongs to the Most High God. All honor belongs to the King of Kings because His will is for us to make, a disi make disciples and He will be the one to sort them out. So I'm grateful for your learnings. I'm grateful for you 
all coming here again and again time after time even with the prophetic words that is being shared sometimes the lord rebukes all of us sometimes he gives us correction sometimes he encourages us sometimes he releases promises over each and of our lives but we humbly accept it as the lord basically leads us to and i just want to say thank you also for your patience through it all yes i know there is a dimension where we're going through <laughs> healing you know and the words are coming out we're going through healing and this is always my prayer because it's my prayer for each and every one of us according to colossians 1 19 to come into the fullness of jesus christ and the reason why sometimes we understand that the fullness is not manifesting is because of the things that we've picked on along the way religion lied to us some of these doctrines they lied to us you know the parents at the same time they didn't teach us what was right now being reconciled to the father he takes those things off so that the lights in you can basically shine a lot brighter so i am not reading the bible for you <laughs> like i would say i'm reading it for myself and what i basically learned is what he encourages me to share with you and i'm grateful because you know why freely he gave me and freely i have been able to give it to you and continue to do so as he leads me to do so you all have been absolutely amazing in itself you know because i know time and time again sharing a word consistently repeating myself consistently that's just the lord because he's helping each and every one of us to understand that i am sowing a seed because not all of you will get it straight away maybe some people they will get it in two months time some people they will get it in three years time in four years time but the seed has already been sown because eventually when it brings forth harvest do you see then you will remember i have heard this before somewhere because it's not just me teaching this there are many lovely and wonderful teachers apostles prophet pastors that are actually teaching the same thing and i'm grateful for each and every one of them so it is to that that i just want to honor them and honor you too and thank you for just your time and your moments that you've been here I want to appreciate you because you all, you, the love that you are is so beautiful. And yes, you know, Holy Ghost helps me to understand that majority of you through here, you know, you're learning, you're receiving the testimonies that is happening in your life. I am so grateful because I know that, you know, I've always been sharing that your testimony is the spirit of prophecy. So you can't just share your testimony, but you have to share it as the Lord leads you to share it. Can you see that dimension? But I know that majority of you, you've received miracles, you've received testaments. The Lord has basically, you followed, has allowed you to follow instructions in obedience. And I just want to thank God for your obedience. Yes, I, you know, it, it pleases my heart to learn of your obedience because that is what the Father loves. He says that what? Obedience is better than sacrifice. You obey now now and then he can help you to understand why you obeyed later you can see and that is what brings joy to my heart your obedience so i love each and every one of you for your obedience because you are absolutely beautiful people like i always say and i've said it before love is the foundation of it all everything that we learn we learn through love and I know that, you know, the Father basically correcting each and every one of us, helping us to go on the right path, to stay on the right path so none of us fall. And eventually at the same time, when the word is released, majority of you in the spirit, you're praying as the word is being released. And as you're praying, look at the dimensions of what is happening in creation. Creation is being reconciled. Look at it. The planes, you know, we thank God that the angel is holding them from falling down. The animals, gradually, they are being reconciled to the Father. And the people around you are experiencing the light that you are illuminating through you. Thank you. Thank you so very much for making my work easy. And for just helping, you know, your prayers, you know, your prayers has led to so many promotions. Your prayers help me to pass the test. Your prayers helps me to just ascend at the same time. 
And that is always my prayer for you too. Do you see that in itself? And this is the reason why I have come to say thank you. Because I can't keep doing this without coming back to say thank you. To those who keep sharing the word to friends and families and those around them. I want to say thank you. I really want to say thank you. I really want to say thank you to each and every one of you for all that you have been doing in standing with me concerning this journey. Thank you so, so very much. And I appreciate you all because you all, you all are just beautiful people. And I just want to say thank you to you all because you are the reason why we are here serving you. And it's an honor to serve you all. The Lord continue to be with you. Continue to uphold you. And it is to that that I just want to share this prayer. If you will let me. Because this is my prayer for you. Numbers chapter 6. Verse 24. It says the Lord bless you. And keep you. The Lord make his face shine on you. And be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face toward you and give you peace and his name is who you are and he's blessing you the lord is blessing you even while you're asleep he's blessing you so it is to that i just want to say thank you to everybody i love you all so so very much and may the peace of the lord that surpasses all understanding continue to guard your heart and your mind i bless you all with life in jesus name Amen. God bless you.